how to install oxygen os 10 based on android 10 from the oneplus 60 on your redmi k20 pro or the xiaomi mi 90 pro if you haven't already subscribed make sure you subscribe to the channel and click on the bell icon to get notified of new videos hey peeps what's up manji here back with another video and in this video i'm going to show you how you can install oxygen os 10 based on android 10 from the oneplus 6t on your redmi k20 pro or the xiaomi p90 pro what are the prerequisites for this video the prerequisites for this video are you need to have an unlocked bootloader and you need to have twerp recovery installed how do you do that i have separate videos for both of those which are linked in the description of the video next thing make sure you have a backup of all your pictures videos and anything important which you have on your device because if we run into any encryption issues or any boot loops then you will have to do a format data from to up recovery in which case you are going to lose all your pictures videos and anything important which you have on your device also make sure your battery is charged at least 50 to 60 percent do not do this process if your battery is at 20 or 30 percent let us first go into settings and about phone as you can see i am running MIUI 11 global stable version 11.0.3.0 based on Android 10 on my Redmi K20 Pro. Another thing I would like to add is that my device is not encrypted. So I'll go into settings, password and security, privacy and encryption and credentials mentions that my phone is not encrypted. What does this mean? This means that I will have to flash disable force encryption after I flash Oxygen OS 10 ROM zip file on my redmi k20 pro if you flash your device very frequently i do recommend that you go ahead and decrypt your device how do you do that i have a separate video for that as well which is again linked in the description of the video we'll first go into settings password and security and remove the password the fingerprint unlock and the face unlock once that is done you will go back and then you will scroll down go into me account and remove your me account once you have removed your me account then we'll go into accounts and sync and remove your google account as well once you've removed all the accounts and security measures you need to reboot your device once why are we removing all the accounts and security measures we are removing all the accounts and security measures because we are going from one rom to another and i don't want you peeps to be locked out of your own device as for the files which we need these are all the files which you need so you need disable force encryption zip file then you need the oxygen os 10 rom which is from the oneplus 60 this zip file has your system your vendor and your boot image then you need magisk yes you do need to root if you want the pop-up camera to work properly you do need another file which is the extension mdr and that file is used to ensure that the pop-up camera works absolutely fine once you have downloaded all the files removed all the security measures confirmed that all the security measures have removed successfully we need to boot into to up recovery for that the first thing we need to do is turn off our device once that is done press and hold volume up and power button at the same time till you see the to up recovery boot loop once we have booted into to up recovery we'll go into wipe advanced wipe and select dalvik cache system vendor and data and then swipe to wipe as you can see i am getting a message that unable to decrypt fbe device however this does not affect the rom flashing process in any way next click on the home button go into install and now you need to navigate to the folder where you have downloaded all the files in case you downloaded the files on your phone directly they will be in the download folder in my case i have transferred them manually from my computer so they are in the root directory the first file which we need to select is the oxygen os 10 rom port from the oneplus 60 the zip file select the file and then swipe to confirm flash once the file has flashed successfully click on the home button go into mount and then select vendor once that is done go back go into install and the next file which we need to flash is the disable force encryption select the file and then swipe to confirm flash a very important thing to note while flashing disable force encryption is that you do get a message that it is patching some f stabs if you do not get any path over there that means that no f stabs were patched and 
the window was not mounted correctly once this is done all you need to do is go into reboot and select system however if you run into any boot loops or any encryption issues you will have to boot back into torp recovery by pressing and holding volume up and power button at the same time till you see the torp recovery boot logo then you'll go into wipe format data and type in yes and then click on the check mark button on the bottom right of the keyboard as i mentioned earlier a format data will result in wiping out of all your pictures videos and anything important which you have on your device so make sure you have a backup of all those things for now we're going to skip that step going to reboot and select system and bam there it is we have the oxygen os boot animation on our redmi k20 pro which means our device is booting into oxygen os 10 based on android 10 from the oneplus 6t you might have noticed that the camera is popped out however need not worry we are going to fix that down the line in this video and now that we are on the setup screen we're going to skip the initial setup real quick however if you feel like setting up your face data go ahead and do so face unlock will work absolutely fine if oneplus launcher asks for permission click on allow and now we can go into settings and about phone there it is we are running oxygen os 10 based on android 10 from the oneplus 6t on our redmi k20 pro the next thing we need to do is root our device by installing magisk so we're going to turn off our device and then once the device has turned off press and hold volume up and power button at the same time till you see the tour recovery boot logo once you are into up recovery we'll click on install and now you again need to navigate to the folder where you downloaded all the files and just select the magisk zip file and then swipe to confirm flash once magisk has installed successfully we're going to just click on reboot system and then boot back into oxygen os 10 on our redmi k20 pro back into oxygen os we're going to unlock our device and there it is you can see that an application is asking for super user request you need to click on grant once this is done we'll go into settings and then you need to scroll down and go into the option called hard settings it will ask you for access to storage location and phone you need to click on continue and then the next thing you need to do is click on ok it will also ask for super user request click on grant once this is done we will click on sensors and modules and then you need to click on automatic camera position it will give you an introduction about macro droid just tap on the next icon for four or five times next thing we need to do is click on export import and here you need to select local storage under import so you have two options under import local storage and android share we will select local storage click on allow next thing click on the three dot menu on the top right and then select show internal storage then click on the three bar menu on the top left select your device in this case oneplus 60 as we are running the oneplus 60 rom port on our redmi k20 pro and now you need to select the dot mdr file which you had downloaded so we are going to select this file it says it needs access to accessibility click on ok select macro droid enable the use service click on allow then you can go back go back one more time and now we need to reboot our device once we have rebooted our device we will unlock it and bam there it is you can see that the camera went down on its own that is because we imported the .mdr file into our oxygen os 10 on the redmi k20 pro i'll turn off bluetooth and rotation and macro droid requires permission just dismiss that notification so that you don't get it and now whenever you lock and unlock your device the pop-up camera will automatically open and if it detects your face and you have set up face unlock face unlock will be working like a boss so here it is as soon as i lock and unlock the device the camera popped up and then it went back down so there it is peeps that is how you install and set up oxygen os 10 based on android 10 from the oneplus 60 on your redmi k20 pro and before i forget in case the pop-up camera does not work for you that would be because you are not giving root access to the applications which is the macro application and the other application so you can go into magisk manager three bar menu on the top left go into super user and make sure that 
hard control and macro droid have access to super user or root and that will do it for this video hope my video helped you likes shares and subscribes are appreciated feedback and comment more than welcome see you when i see you <laughs>